Hello everyone, it's Daryl Campbell here coming at you with another video and today we're doing something a little bit different. As some of you may know from videos past, we've done a little bit of forte into beauty. First of all, I use some Clarify Balancing Daily Moisturizer. But we've never actually gone on a haul. That's right, haul videos are very popular and they show off different products from a particular company. Now, I was in my local supermarket and I noticed a particular beauty brand released a seasonal aeroplanes. Aren't they the best invention in the world? They're the best! Line of products. So for today's video, I picked up a bunch of Mco beauty products for me to try here on the YouTube channel and we're just gonna see how they perform. Quick disclaimer for today's video, I paid for all of these products on my own. So this is a not sponsored video. <laughs> Future day, I'll make sure you do flashy, flashy, flashy things. <laughs> so if you wanna watch me try out a whole bunch of seasonal makeup and skincare related products, then please keep on watching. So just to run down the products that I have today, I've got the five piece natural skincare collection, which by the way, this 2022, I am going to endeavor to look after my skin more. As you can see, it is not in great shape. Hashtag try skin fitness, I don't know. Then we've got a whole bunch of products from the summer edit range. First up, we've got this glow body balm in the shade bronze. I love the packaging of this by the way. Um, this was themed in and around Christmas and this video is coming out on a non-disclosed day. So enjoy that. <laughs> then we've got the chick, cheek, the chink, wow. The Cheek and Lip 2-in-1 Tint in the shade Flamingo Pink. Next we've got the All Balm All Over Ointment in the shade Watermelon. Then we've got the Summer Edit 7-pack um, Mini Balm Mega Balm Collection. That's an apple. And there are different shades in here that you can get. And there's different flavors that you can get. And I nearly threw the packaging at you. Woo! <laughs> we gotta have fun! Alright, let's get started on this skincare collection. I think we're just gonna go left to right on this one. It's like Christmas Day! Woo! Except my wrapping skills on Christmas Day are something to be left to be desired. Uh, okay. MK Beauty has these lovely uh, pink packaging as well. All right, starting from left to right, which I assume is what you've got. Um, Australian made, natural, no sulfates, per beans, PEG, mineral oil, or palm oil. Gets a long quality skin care at the fraction of a price. Oh, I should have kept the receipt so I knew how much to claim on tax. I mean, to, <laughs> to show you on this video. First up, we've got the Aha Biha Pore Refining and Exfoliating Toner. Soak a clean cotton pad with toner and gently apply to the skin as needed. Okay, I'm gonna get some cotton buds, I'll be back. I have my trusty pa I think, packet of Q-tips here. I don't have a cotton pad per se, but I do have Q-tips. So, it says to Soak a clean cotton pad tone with toner and gently apply to the skin when needed. Okay. Which is all of it. <laughs> deep, 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 deep. Okay. So I'm just going to start rubbing this all over my face. I've 
avoiding the delicate eye area. Okay. In all seriousness, though, I do need to uh, work on my skin fitness. I think skin, skin care, and skin fitness for me has been something that has been left to be desired in the last couple of years because uh, definitely not something I have seen as a high priority which it should be I mean you should all sort of take care of yourself in whichever way you seem possible oh. My, my bags! My Gucci bags. It also says to follow with the MCO Beauty Hydrating and Hydraulic Acid and Vitamin C Face Serum, which, funnily enough, we have here. Let's read about this. Hydrating Hydraulic Acid and Vitamin C is like a tall drink of water for your skin. <gasps> Great, amazing. Skin loving power ingredients, hydraulic acid, vitamin B E B B E B3 <laughs> Vitamin C rich katu plum and hibiscus extra to help retain, moisturize and promote firmness while leaving the skin feeling hydrating and pump. Apply one to two drops to clean skin, then massage gently, focusing on areas that need extra hydration. Alright, step two. In the skin care process. So, one to two drops. One drop, two drop. Ooh, that's a nice... That's a nice colour. And then gently massage in two places that need it, which is my whole face. I've never been to like a beauty salon to like get a proper like a proper like a proper facial I probably should at some point it would do me the world of good the only sort of the only sort of places that I've been beauty wise have been like I get massages I don't want to say often but frequently enough and I also have gotten like a pedicure once by the way once I'm just gonna seen a lot of massage the rest of it been through a lot of around Some things are not the same. like that see glowing already then it says to okay. follow with the Emco beauty hydrating day and night moisturizer which is Way what we have here. next why do all of them come with this packaging that you cannot open one eternity later after a great assemblance of effort we've finally gotten the hydro <laughs> hydrating day night face moisturizer which to use this one apply directly onto the skin focusing on areas of hydration <laughs> Ooh, it smells really good. What is this smell? I'm just getting it all over the face. But I really, I really should go and do more beauty stuff. Do you guys want to see me do more beauty stuff? Let me know down below. I'm really interested in learning how to do more self-care. I realized that on the most recent hiatus with the two was to how self-care is really important. What do I do with these excess? Got it in my hands, I guess. That's really good. This must be working because my skin right now is just going into hyperdrive. It's just like ah, clean, 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 clean. Right. Um, that's going to be the last step. So, before we move on, let's try these other two products in the skincare box. <laughs> Five piece natural skincare collection. Let's try the Salic Foaming Face Cleanser. Oh, this is, this is runny. This is not what I thought this would be. Uh, how do we do this one? Massage cleanser onto wet skin. Rinse and rinse. Ooh. All right. Well, um, 
that's why it's wet, I guess. All right, I will do this one in the bathroom and I'll okay. come back. And I'm back. And that was the Silic Foaming Face Cleanser. Holy moly, this one was the one that I felt the most active working. It is still actively working and it is, it's intense. <laughs> <laughs> Lastly in this set, we've got a gentle vitamin C exfoliating face scrub, which, which I will go and use because apparently it also needs water. So I will go apply this and I'll be right back. That concludes the five piece natural skincare collection from Emco Beauty. And I will say my face has not felt more cleansed. Like I have not spent that much attention on my face and the skin as I should have. It definitely helps. It definitely is a skincare routine. Like I, there is no way that I have time in my day for each and every single one of these products to use. Like I've been filming this this bit for 30 minutes now. <laughs> so definitely something like for the whole start to finish is definitely not something I would do every day. Definitely will keep the hydrating day night one out and probably face cleanser as well. Those were definitely my two favorites. Now we're on to the fun part of the video. Yay! But first I'm gonna leave one more time, get my base and my face sorted with my regular get ready routine that I'm gonna do off camera now because you've seen it in a number of videos and you've seen how well it goes when I do it on camera. This is gross. I'm squirting it on my face again. <sighs> It feels so weird! So I'm gonna pause and I'm gonna be right back. Let's use, uh, let's use the cheek and lip 2 and 1 tint in the shade Pink Flamingo. I love this packaging. I mean, this packaging is so good. Using your fingers or a brush, apply directly to the cheek and lips to add a flash of color. I could use a flash of color, I think. I don't know how much to use. Oh, that's a lot. <laughs> that's, 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 that's a lot. Oh no. Oh, I've used way too much. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I'm gonna get clowned. I definitely. I'm getting clowned. This side's not terrible. But this side I used way too much. <laughs> Let's see if I can fix this. Okay, thankfully, I still had my sponge with product on it. And then I can just blend it in. Oh, look at this though. There you go. There you go. Oh, yes. That actually isn't awful. <laughs> From clown to clever. <laughs> See, now, now you've got that. You just had to, you just had to blend it in. You just had to blend in. No, don't do that. What about lips? Uh, should I? No, I'm gonna try it on lips. I'm gonna put it here. I'm gonna try it on lips after lips are done. But that adds, that does add a little bit of color. Look at that. Now, let's do the Glow Body Balm in bronze. Ooh, this one's in a little bit of a different packaging. It's more red than pink, which is okay. We suggest patch testing first. All right, so this is not something for your face, I take it? Let's see how we go. I reckon if I do it on my hand, it should be okay. Oh, that feels funny. Let's try it on my hand. I don't know if it's coming up on the camera. Let's use my underarm, because that's more, that's more white. <laughs> white. <laughs> oh, let's not do that. Oh, okay, okay, that's a bit of fun, right? Though I don't see how, 
It is just a bomb. Sun-kissed glory. I mean, I guess. But I don't... I don't see the appeal of it. It did... It did hydrate it, and it did... So there's my other arm. And there's my arm with it on. I suppose there is a little bit of a difference. But definitely not much. I... I'm gonna say least favourite so far. Next! Let's try this mega bomb. I'm excited for this. Let me know if you're enjoying this video because this, again, this is not really something I'm used to doing. So please let me know if you're enjoying it. Let's do this mega bomb. In the shade of watermelon. Oh. You guys, I wish you could smell this. Smell that, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, I'm just putting it on my lips, I think. Get a little bit more. This looks so funny. Ooh. It's not as, it doesn't hold together. Well, at all. Hmm. And it doesn't, it doesn't taste all that good either. Aw. That's a little bit disappointing. A little disappointed by that. Oh well. <laughs> that happens. Let's try some of these more smaller, compacter Mega Bombs and see if that fixes the problem. It's a seven pack, which I don't know. I don't know who thought it would be a good idea to do a seven pack. Because you get two of three flavors and only one of this yellow flavor. So seven's a bit of an, it is literally an odd number. It doesn't tell me what the flavors are. So that's exciting. This is in the, sh this is in the flavor something. Peach. Ooh. I like that. That I do love. That, that, that I can vibe with. Second flavor out of the three is this white one. <laughs> That's what people refer to me as, is this white one. Hmm. Vanilla, maybe? I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. This one I know for a fact is the watermelon. That's watermelon. If only I had someone to kiss to, you know. How are we out of here? <laughs> Just kidding, I'm all alone. Anyway. Ha, just kidding, I'm all alone. Then we've got this last one, which is the single flavor. Banana? Yeah, banana. That's banana. Banana flavored chapstick. Who would have thought? Mega bomb, ladies and gentlemen. Those were a lot better than, than the big one. I, I would rather this mini pack rather than this large pack because this large pack also is going to be hard to store uh, if I was to go out on the go or to go traveling again I think keeping one of these in my beauty bag rather than this is definitely definitely more beneficial well I'm kind of wow I'm kind of ruined that baggage now haven't I <laughs> uh, also they had eyeshadows in the summer edit I am not huge on eyeshadows. I've never dabbled in it, so it's not really something that I have dabbled in. Oh, we were going to do this chip and link tint on the lips now. Oh god, this is going to go. This is going to go well. Again, I'm not going to use much. I'm using that much. That's a nice colour. I do like that colour a lot. It's a tint, not a lipstick, so... I do like that. There you go. This concludes the MCO Beauty Haul that I have been on. Again, none of this was sponsored. None of this was paid for. I paid for this with all of my own money. So I hope you enjoyed these honest reviews and Hopefully you take away something from this uh, and if you can get the summer edit um, or any of these products individually, I do recommend them. 
Favorites and least favorites. Let's go back to the skincare collection. My favorite in the skincare collection was the Hydrating Day and Night Cream. I do love a good all-purpose cream. And the smell was amazing. Again, the face serum I think has to be my least favorite in that collection. In the summer edit, least favorite goes to this Mega Balm. That's, it's unfortunate. And my favorite I think is this Chicken Lip 2-in-1 tin. I think I can see myself using this a little bit more often to bring some color back, but now I know not to use 500 drops in one go because it does go a long way. All right, everyone, that's gonna do it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I do greatly appreciate it. If you'd like to like and subscribe, that'd be greatly appreciated as well. Comment what was your favorite part of today's video and have you got some products for me to try in the future? Till next time, I've been Dale Campbell coming at ya. I'll see you next time. Bye.